situation is quite straightforward. You do something wrong and there are consequences to that action, yes? So I didn't mean- I'm talking, you're listening. It's more like it. Simple. I say it, you do it. I'll look behind you. I'm going to give you three simple tasks, starting with a spot of litter picking. You can start in the canteen, then make your way outside. You forgot the bib. I don't need a bib! It's non-negotiable, Luke. I'll be down to check on you shortly. This? I've got to take any rubbish around to recycling. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, some over there. What is he playing at? From the state yeah, yeah, it's yeah. all right, thank you. Showing him who's boss, I guess. Humiliating him, more like. Can you give us five minutes? Yeah, no problem. Look, maybe I can tell Miss Campbell that Amy wound you up. I don't care what Campbell thinks of me. You're the one that didn't tell anyone, Luke. Why are you angry at me when you're the one that's in balance? No, I'm not. So that's why he lies to me for six months, is it? Making up stories about why I couldn't come round. Making me feel like maybe I wasn't good enough. You're full of crap. Blaming me is just easier than admitting. You're well shamed about that home. Where, Steph? Stay, Pendle. Can't Loser! <laughs> Do you know that half of all children in care leave school with no GCSEs? 13% get five passes. Are you going to be like that, Luke? Or are you going to be part of the 40% of prisoners who have spent time in care? It's your decision. You missed a bit. Water needs changing. What? Come on, move it. I'm doing it. Yeah, not quick enough. I said I'm doing it. Don't you ever speak to me like that again. Now get it changed. Better let Kim know. So much for executive control, huh? Mm. Yes. It's my car. It's my car! Out the way! This is my life. Do you want to see it? Everyone can find out about me now. Is this what you want? Read it!
make sure they lock you up and throw away the key. I don't care what you do to me. Leave him alone. Let go of him. You. Okay, everyone, back inside, please. Girls, inside, I said. Here we go. I think that's most of them. Chris. Look, can you, can you take Luke out for a second, please? Come on. Stay with him. I'm calling the police. Oh, Max, hang on. Just calm down, all right? Nobody got hurt. Oh, yeah, you're forgetting that he nearly killed no, you. No, please, please, for me. All right? Let's, let's just deal with this on our own. It doesn't need any more discipline. It, it, it just needs a, a little bit of TLC. Max. This is Max Tyler, Waterloo Road Executive Head. I'd like to report a serious incident. Yes, please. Why, love? Why did you do it? I don't know. I, I just lost it. Police are on their way. I'm going to hand this over to them. What'll happen to him? He'll end up with a criminal record. And if he does, it'll be what he deserves. Luke. Luke, why don't you, uh, why don't you tell Mr Tyler why you ended up in care? Mm. Okay. When my dad left my mum and started his new family, she just couldn't look after us anymore. Right, and what age were you? Oh, six. Six. Maybe, um, this'll be the shock he needs. Absolutely it will. What's the point? Could you, could you give me five minutes? Sure. Police will be in here shortly to charge you. Can you think of one good reason why that shouldn't happen? No, sir. Miss Campbell thinks I should give you a second chance. Is she right? She's all right, Miss Campbell. Yes, she is. Thing is, Luke, when you leave here in two years' time, Miss Campbell doesn't leave with you. You have to stand on your own two feet. What I did today was try to make you realise that in life, bad things happen. You have to be ready, which means ready to accept authority. So things just went a bit... I fell out with my girlfriend and everyone was having a go at me. Yes, I heard about that. Don't ever be ashamed of your background, Luke. Just work hard so it's not an issue. That's what I did. When you came to John Foster's, I was delighted. I said, now there's a lad with the brains to really achieve something in life. You do want to achieve something. University, career. Definitely. I want to be a lawyer. Good. But you won't get there if you can't show respect for the people in charge. And in this place, that's me. I'm going to inform the police that we'll be handling this incident. I'm giving you a second chance. Final chance. Yeah, this will be on you from now. I think you can handle it. I can. 
cancer, yeah. Best decision you made all day. Sir, thank you. What do you want? One very contrite young man to see you. Hey, miss. I'm sorry about the garden and everything. What's happened? Took your advice. We're going to deal with this in-house. Less rules, more responsibilities. He's not getting away scot-free. We're still going to keep him behind for the next two or three weeks. Thank you, Max. See you later. See ya. Pastoral approach is the only way we're going to get through to them, love. I'm saying you were right, Kim. It's lovely. Yeah, it's alright. Gosh, Told Amy to bog off. Yeah. Thanks. Right. I didn't know you could drive. <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> so, what's going to happen to you? Mr. Tyler's given him a second chance. His head's down in graft. No more sleepovers, staying out past ten. You understand? I thought they were going to kick you out. Nah, it just means Tyler's going to be on my case, but I'll be alright. Look, I'm sorry that I lied. I mean, I'm just glad it's out now. It be a big relief not having to look both ways every time I leave this place. Look, do you want to stay for tea? It's OK, I better get back. Oh, it'll be all right, please. Yeah, OK.